This is the peak of harvest, planting, and growing crops in Nigeria now. But everything is expensive. Why? I'll tell you in this video. My name is Maria Habila, and I'm an agriculture entrepreneur. I'm an agriculture investor. I make videos about agriculture and all the good things, all the investment opportunity in agriculture and other businesses around Nigeria. Most importantly, everything is centered around money and growing money. So you might like so subscribe to this youtube channel so let's get started why are agri products expensive right now it is because there has been inflation in areas that contribute to the growth and the development of the agriculture in nigeria and so it has a ripple down effect let me break it down to you for instance this is the time where corn is being harvested this is the time where beans is being weeded you know, applied application of fertilizer, you know, grooming of beans has already started in major parts of northern Nigeria, who are the suppliers of beans in Nigeria. Harvest, harvesting of um, rice has also started. And, you know, all of these things are supposed to now make the prices go cheaper. But it's not going cheaper because the production of all of these products was not cheap. I'm going to break it down to you. The cost of production in agri sector this year was double, triple, sometimes even four times the price of what it was last year. And so it's going to affect the eventual outcome because at the end of the day, everybody is looking for profit. Nobody is doing everything, anything here for gain, for charity. Very few people are doing it. Even those who you think are doing it for charity purposes, you need to look again because I don't think it's really about charity everything is basically about profit so let me break it down to you fertilizer was expensive seedlings were expensive chemicals for maintaining and all of that were expensive cost of fuel for mechanized farming diesel all of those things are now expensive were expensive expensive during the time of planting and when is now time to harvest you would have to now calculate every of those expenses that you have put together to bring out this bountiful harvest and try to make calculations, pros and cons, and bring out your profit. And that will not determine market price. So right now, in simple short term, agricultural products are now expensive because cost of agricultural production went astron astronomically high this year. Profit is the major reason why most business owners go into business and do all that they do. By the time they realize that if they sell it at the price of last year, they are not going to make profit. They wouldn't sell it at the price of last year. They will calculate all of their costs, calculate their workmanship, calculate everything, and then divide it amongst the products that they have gotten to determine the price. And that's why things are expensive. So aside fertilizer, chemicals and seedlings to plants let's now move to post-production where you now have transportation and logistics packing and packaging and all that how did that affect the price of things in the market transportation how much is a liter of foam right now in your area some people are selling it for 1500 naira. good now it wasn't like that last year so it's going to affect the cost of product um, prices the cost of product in the market right now, farm product. Let's also talk about climate change. This year there was drought, there was also flood. If it affected some of your farm, you add it to the calculation. Um, drought, if it affected you at some point, you add it also into the calculation. Then also we now talk about um, low income. A lot of people that had, maybe let's say for us now, that sold our corn last year as a 68,000 era. This year, actually, so we bought it 35 and we sold at 68,000 naira. If we're able to sell at 68,000 naira, and right now we are buying it at 75,000 naira, make it make sense. We thought we made profit and we're dancing. I made a video about the profit. If you don't understand what I'm talking about, I run an agri investment company where I help you invest in agri business. So, all you have to do is register. With some of 100,000 naira, this ratio cut across three years going on from 2025 to 2027 by God's grace. And then eventually, when you are registered, you have you are entitled to free telegram calls, you are entitled to consultation and being a member of the group. Now, 
what what's the benefit of being in that group the benefit of being in that group is you get first-hand information on some of the products that we have vetted and think that you will make good profit in one of the major questions i get asked all the time is how much can i make what's the return on investment for agri business it is a i won't call it blind investment i'll just say it is an investment that has low risks but there's risks right so you cannot they cannot tell you exactly how much you can make say for instance we bought um corn now at seventy-five thousand naira. how much am i selling corn i don't know even at one point ask anybody in the market how much will corn eventually be come next year ready to sell nobody knows that anybody who tells you that that person is thief. so basically we just make announcements on how um what we have available what we are vetted and then you send in your money for the number of products that you want number of bags and from there we invest for you we buy we store for you sell for you and send you your money when it's time like we sell when it's time and send you your money everything is in a transparent group so nothing is hidden everything is just open in the air so that everybody understands what is going on and that's how we run our agri investment company so that's why i'm giving you a breakdown of how difficult things are right now most times you buy like when corn came out newly i think i remember the last video i made i was talking about oh, how, how corn was seventy thousand era little did i know that in the next coming week corn was going to be seventy five thousand era so five thousand era added as i now i don't know the price of corn again i'm not even interested no nobody should go ask me because i don't want to get angry things are really really going high